Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Millie and today I'm going to show you the six shops at the silos. You've been requesting this, so I'm going to show you each one of them and how they look now. And also the new furnace retro shop that opened just recently. I'm going to show you all of it. But first, if you are new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe if you like this type of content. I upload new videos every week. Okay, so let's get started. It's been a while since I filmed the shops and I'm so glad I'm back and doing it again. These boutique stores have been curated by Joanna Gaines with a specific style and theme in mind, from bath and body products, men's provisions, bags and jewelry, women's clothing, and books and paper products. First is the number 16 shop named after Chip Gaines baseball jersey number from back in the day and this collection is filled with both modern and retro goods, all Chip's favorites. And now with Father's Day coming up I think it's perfect for gift ideas. Next is Chapter 1, the Paper Goods Store, and this collection was inspired by the idea of putting pen to paper and chasing your dreams. And as you can see, the layout of this shop is beautiful, I love all the details, very inspiring. Next is the Bath & Body Shop, Vivian and Me, that means a life well loved, and you will find here a nice collection of Bath & Body products including skincare, makeup and beauty tools, as you can see also beautiful, like a little French boutique.
next is tried and true with a great selection of bags, jewelry and other accessories. If you like simple dainty jewelry pieces, then you would like this store. I like the bags too, you know those neutral colors, very cute. Next is Reverie, a women's clothing store filled with well-made evergreen pieces. You can see all these pieces were selected by Joanna, it's definitely her style. And instead of the children's clothing store, now here it's the furnished retro plant shop owned by Joanna's sister, Mikey. And this store is inspired by Mikey's love for finding vintage pots, mugs and vessels to put the perfect little plant in. And as you can see, this is a very beautiful store filled with all these plants in these cute vintage pots, mugs all these accessories, very cute. Then I entered to the church that is in the middle of the shops and this old church was constructed using elements preserved from an abandoned church across town, built in 1894, was one of Waco's oldest buildings, until it eventually closed and sat vacant for over 30 years and in 2017 Chip and Joanna bought the building, restored it and finally in 2020 they decided to move the old church to the silos grounds.
So let me know what do you think of the shops at the silos, which shops you like the most. I think they complement the silos very well, makes it all cozy. And I'm going to show you a little more of the silos. As you know, my perfect spot here are the gardens next to the seed and supply store that in this time of the year looks so beautiful. It's always great to visit the silos, especially in this time of the year. And on my next video, I'm going to show you Magnolia Home and all the summer collection that is there right now. So if you want to see it, don't forget to subscribe and click in the red bell notification so you can get notified every time I upload a new video. So I hope you like this video. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.